I'm sitting here thinking about if the earth is spinning or not. You know, man. I'm sitting here like, am I spinning right now, man? A lot of, a lot of my nagas is like, man, who cares, drop, man? I mean, not my nagas, but a lot of my peoples out there is like, man, who cares, drop? I'm just sitting here wondering if I'm spinning or not, man. Is you spinning, man? <laughs> Why does it matter, man? Um, a lot of, I mean, this is probably the number one question. Especially a hijack's gonna ask, but even like, you know, real noggers that just, it's like, man, look, man, I gotta go to work. You know what I'm saying? I, I gotta pop off. I ain't tripping about if I'm spinning or not. I don't care if NASA's lying to me. I don't care if they're lying to my children. Why does it matter, Drive? You know, that's their number one thing is why does it matter? I mean, I could tell you that uh, no one likes being lied to. No one likes our children being lied to. Um, you know, I could tell you that it matters just psychologically if you're spinning or not. You should know if you're spinning, man, you know? I, I, can't, I can't raise a child that thinks they're spinning when they're not spinning. I, I, I can't raise a child teaching them a fact about them spinning when, it's, when gravity's a theory, man. You know what I'm saying? If gravity's a theory, then you have no earth spinning on a ball with quadrillions of tons of water being crushed and not going off into the vacuum of nothingness, the vacuum of space. Gravity's not, you know, um, <laughs> water's not just pouring out into outer space because of some magical gravity. I can tell you all that and you're like, yeah, who cares, man? I, I, I got bills to pay, drop. Why does it matter, man? You know what, I think the main thing is the question is, why does it matter to them? You know, like if somebody's lying to you and they got hella lies and then lies on top of lies and you're like, damn man, why are you doing all this lying? I normally wouldn't care about my popcorn machine being broke, but you lying to me about how my popcorn machine got broke. <laughs> you telling me it's fixed when it's broke. I gotta look into this now. like. It could be something as small as a popcorn machine and just the amount of lies about it will make you interested and say, why you have to lie to me about my popcorn machine? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, the earth is way more important than a popcorn machine. The earth is our habitat. The earth is created by the creator. Wow, you know what I mean? It's important because the creator is important. You know, if the creator created this habitat for you, for us to pop off, it matters because it's the creator's handiwork, right? The firmament is the handiwork of Hawa. The firmament is the handiwork of the creator. It matters that the handiwork of Hawa matters. You know, I understand your job matter. I understand all these jammers is happening today and you trying to get over this and you don't care about, you know, science versus you know, independent scientists, geocentrists versus heliocentrists, centricities. You don't care if you're spinning or not right now, but you care about the creator. You, you don't think the creator wants you to know what kind of habitat the creator has created? You think the creator wants you to be so busy that you just don't care about all the beautiful work and and art and artistry, perfection that's been put onto this earth, the, the secrets of this earth. You worried about outer space? One big reason why it matters, man, is imagine having like another America out there somewhere, another Africa out there, another Asia, full of people that look just like you. And because you're being enclosed, your mind is being enclosed thinking that you're isolated on a bunch of spinning balls and you can't travel to each other unless you become astronauts and travel into hyper outer space and go into warp drive and go into light years, everything so far with light years away. You think everything's so far away. You don't know you can get there by just taking a boat. And they ain't letting Nagas, you know, cross these barriers, right? So. It also matters because we got family, man, across the plane, man. You know, think about the fam, man. You know, they, 
they may or may not be conscious of us. You know what I'm saying? We're just now getting conscious into the fact that there's more worlds beyond the pole. But really it matters because it matters to them, man. Trillions and trillions of dollars they spend it. Trillions, quadrillions of dollars into hiding this thing. NASA's and SpaceX's and all these trillions of dollar black budget operations and all this space travel just to find out that it's just more water. More space is just more water, my nigga. Just keep going. Just keep going straight on your boat. Take your plane, just go straight. All the rockets, the, the rockets never go up. They just always go like this. Like airplanes, because they go to more land. Celebrities going missing. I mean, Tupac could be over there on another land beyond a pole, man. You care about Pac, man? <laughs> so I'm just saying, like, it matters because... For some reason, it matters to them a lot. They would go through all this trouble, man. A Challenger space mission, you know what I'm saying? They still popping up today. Such a big lie. And you gotta say why. Not just why it mattered to me, but why does it matter so much to them? What are they really hiding? And, and what's the relevance of whatever they're hiding to whatever's about to happen, right? They talking aliens and false flag. Uh, alien invasions and like, nah, we're just talking about more Nagas across the plane, man. More Africa's, more Asia's, more Americas. Not some green aliens, man. But they got Avatar, they got blue people. But well, those blue people are supposed to be indigenous people getting invaded just like you. So these blue green people are just us, man. More us, man. Care about the creator's handiwork. Care about the firmament that the creator's so proud of, man. You know what I'm saying? The, the crystal dome and how big is this dome and you know how many lands are covered how many domes are there is there a great great dome uh, i love the dizzle fitty man great re recon we've been doing is it 178 worlds underneath one dome and smaller lesser domes why does it matter so much to them man why are they lying about it just even if you think they're telling the truth even if you think your oppressor would tell you the truth about your habitat about your orientation, just say, what if they're lying? What if they don't love us? What if they will lie to you, lie to your children? You know, put them into some framework that they spin in forever, spin in forever, and they never gonna have one still moment, my noggin. That's hijack city, man. You know what I'm saying? That's hijack city, man. That you gotta be spinning forever. It's hijack city. You can't fall back. You can't fall back and just have one still moment. You can't just fall back and just relax and know you ain't spinning. I'm just saying, my noggin, it matters to them. So why would it matter to your oppressor so much and not matter to you? What about the other noggins across the plane? Does that matter? What about Hawaii's handiwork? Does that matter? At some point, these things do gotta matter because they want us to be distracted chasing paper money and plastic, getting plastic cars. Meanwhile, they over there exploring gold and treasures and natural resources, beautiful land all across the planet. I'm not saying, you know, we able to take our plane or take our train or, or take our boat today, but it might matter for whatever is happening, whatever is to come. You know, maybe we gonna get help from some of our Nagas. Maybe they want us to think that it's just an alien invasion. Maybe we got some dragons popping up, man. Look out for the dragon drop. Free Phoenix, man. I love y'all, man. Just just know it do matter because clearly they spending trillions of dollars to cover up this lie. Underground bunkers covering up this lie. All kinds of hijacked textbook, public school information is hijacked just to cover up this lie. You don't care? Well, they care. They care. It's like saying, you know, you in a fight, you getting slapped in the head, but you don't care about it because you distracted. But they care enough to keep slapping you in the head, so eventually you gotta say, wait, I'm in a fight. Maybe I should put some defense up, man. Maybe I should bob and weave a little bit, slip some shots, get some head movement, get some footwork going. That's all we're saying is get some footwork going, man. And keep the water flowing. Hey, the water to the cars. Why does it matter? Why does it matter to them, man? All praise of why.